Notion reminders are a game changer for productivity. In this video, I'll cover the two ways that you can set up Notion reminders. I'll also show you how to set up Notion recurring tasks as a lot of people see them as a similar idea or get them confused with reminders. And at the end, I'll show you the two settings that you need to double check in your Notion account to ensure this is actually working properly. Subscribe for Notion tutorials, let's dive in. All right, the first one here is very simple. Let's say you write something such as buy groceries. If you do this at symbol, so by the way, this here is just normal text. If you do the at symbol after that, you can see here, remind me. So if I click here on remind me, by default, it will be tomorrow at 9 a.m. That's when the reminder will be sent out. But if I click here, I can actually change these settings. So what I could do is say, change this to 6 a.m. And obviously it doesn't have to be tomorrow. You can select any day that you want in the future, obviously not in the past. So it's literally as simple as that. And I'll do a screenshot. This here is what that looks like. So this here is option one. Let's have a look at option two. For this one here, we'll need a database. So I'll just do a new database and call this tasks. And for this, let's say I have a doctor's appointment. And for this to work, I'm going to need a property of the date property. So I'll click here on date. Now, if you're new to Notion databases, this here is being viewed as a table, but I can view this same data here as a calendar as well. So these here are the same data, but I'll just see it as a calendar as well. So if I click here on doctors and I'll say that is tomorrow, if I click here on calendar, I can then see this doctor's appointment here tomorrow. But doctor's appointments are typically at a specific time, not just a whole day event. So what I'll do here is include time. And now I can change this to, let's say 7 a.m. So now I have this doctor's appointment at 7 a.m. Now to set this reminder, what I'll do is scroll down and here you can see remind. And I can change this now to a bunch of different options. I can do at the time of event, which is probably not very useful for a doctor's appointment. So I can do here two hours before, or one hour before. So I'll click that. So this here is what the Notion notification looks like. So inside of Notion. And then this here is what the email looks like. So with these types of reminders, you'll get emails. So that's what this looks like. For this last example, I use headquarters, which is my premium Notion template. There's a link in the description if you're interested. And what we're going to do here is click on the down arrow on your calendar slash task list. So these here are the same thing. Just like in the last example, this list here is the same thing as this calendar. These two here are the same. And what we'll do is click on the down arrow to add a template. So this here is a page template. So let's just say as an example, we have run club tomorrow. So I'll write out run club and then I can add in any relevant buckets and stuff. So this here is to do with fitness. I probably don't need a project or anything. If I want, I can add default time tracking, let's say 30 minutes for this run club. And let's make this a habit as well. So now when I click away, I've created this template. So if we click now on these three dots here, what we can do is repeat. So I'll click here on repeat and we can say, how often do we want this to be repeated? So let's say here, we want this to be every single week and I can select here multiple days. I could say Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, let's just say Sunday here. And here where it says at, we have around midnight. So this is when it will be generated. So I could say here, I want it to be generated at around midnight and I'll click here on save. So now you can see here, this will get created. So basically tomorrow when you wake up, you'll have this run club page sitting in here. Okay, let's go through the two settings. The first one is how to get emails for your reminders. And the second one is how to get phone notifications for your reminders. So for emails, what you want to do is click on settings, then click on notifications, and then turn on this setting to get emails for your database reminders. You can also turn on Slack notifications here if you're interested. Now for the phone notification, you'll need to use the Notion app on your phone. And when you're on there, you can go to notifications and settings, and click on the push mobile notifications. If you're interested in headquarters and wanna see the full tour for my Notion template, then click on this video here. Thanks for watching, I hope you found this useful.